Hi and welcome everyone. So today I'm gonna tell you about the dielectrics. So now what are the dielectrics? So you can see that the dielectrics are the insulating materials who are a very poor conductor of electric current. When dielectrics are placed in an electric field, practically no current flows in them but instead the electric polarization occurs. Now what is the meaning of the electric polarization? So when a dielectric is placed in an external electric field, its molecules gains electric dipole moment and the dielectric is said to be polarized. So means they shift only slightly different from their average equilibrium position causing dielectric polarization. So there is a difference between an insulator and a dielectric and that is an insulator opposes the flow of electrons or charges while the dielectric stores the electric charges. Dielectric materials can be polarized while insulators cannot be polarized. Dielectrics are insulating materials which transmit electric effect without actually conducting electricity. There are three types of states, solid state, liquid state and the gaseous state. So some of the examples of the solid dielectric materials are paper, glass, mica etc and for the liquid we have distilled water, transformer oil and for the gas dielectrics dry air, helium, nitrogen so these are and perfect vacuum is also a dielectric and dielectrics are of two types non-polar and the polar and the non-polar dielectric the molecules in which the center of positive charge coincide with the center of negative charge are called as non-polar molecules such molecules are symmetric in shape it has zero dipole moment because the negative of electron and nucleus coincide with each other as the centers are at one point only for example in oxygen carbon dioxide methane etc so as we know that non polar means polar means which have plus and minus means polarity but in the non polar there is no polarity means uh, zero dipole moment there is no distance between two charges so and the second one is polar dielectric so if the center of the positive and negative charges do not coincide because of the asymmetric shape of the molecules then they are called Polar molecules means they have the distance between the charges. For example, in HCl, H2O, NH3. So these are the polar molecules or the polar dielectrics. So this is about the dielectrics and the types of dielectrics. So thank you everyone for watching.